Go. Okay, so this is the application started. Uh, as you can see, there's a leap motion set up uh, in front of a sheet of plexiglass um, between the leap motion and the computer. So we've started in um, an edit mode, but we haven't calibrated where the plexiglass is. Um, we start out with a couple buttons defined for us. Uh, one is just going to be a fun functional button. One is going to allow us to edit uh, or to toggle whether we're in edit mode or not. Um, and one is going to control whether or not our mouse is free. So those we're just going to draw. Then we're going to actually calibrate where this uh, drawable plane is by placing our finger there and pressing a button on the keyboard. Uh, so by doing that, we should now be able to press these buttons and see what they do. Uh, so let's see whether this first one's going to work. Uh, so we've seen now that we've pressed the button on the plexiglass and I've activated that um, and turned it back off. So now let's actually draw our own button. Up in the top corner we can see uh, of the screen it tells us the action that we're on is um, increased threshold. I don't want that. So I can swipe my hand uh, across the leap to change that action. Now we're going to change the color. So then I go up to the screen and I'm able to just draw a square and eventually we'll get a button out of it. Bam. So there, we see that. Now we want to actually turn our edit mode off because we've created the button that we're interested in. So we go up and we hit that. Now it's off. The buttons aren't on the screen, but they're still on the plexiglass. So I can go up to the plexiglass and hit the button and it should change the color on the screen, which you see that it's doing. Uh, so we can change the color to a blue, maybe to more of a pink, uh, more of a green and blue. Uh, then we can go, and we can turn our edit mode back on, uh, and add some more buttons if we'd like. Uh, so now we're going to, let's see, what do we want? We already have that. Jesus Christ. Okay, now we're going to go add one more button. We can draw that over here. And then again, turn our edit mode off. And this button uh, actually does something the same as the button we already have. Uh, but that's fine. We were able to add this dynamically. Uh, cool.